Hi, this is Jeremy from Plume Bindings. I'm the International Sales Manager and today we are going to talk about Tuto and how to change the heel fork on the Race 120 bindings along with the heel valve. So to proceed to the change the operations, you are going to need a few tools such as a hammer, a pin drifter 1.5 millimeters, a pin drifter 2.5 millimeters, some grease. So you need to know that the pin which is maintaining the fork is asymmetrical, so you, you will have to punch it from one side to the other side. So my advice is to face the tip of the ski, use the small pin drifter, punch the pin from the right to the left. Okay. So then let's remove the valve and finally pull out the titanium fork. And then you have your two kits. So the titanium fork, especially made for the race 120 bindings and the valve with two pins and the Teflon washers inside. First of all, let's start with the titanium fork. So as you can see, the forks are grooved. So the grooved parts must go on top. And you press and make sure the grooved part is aligned with the heel hole here. Then you open up the other pocket with the valve and then you need to put the Teflon washers inside here. Then you place the valve on the heel. So make sure it's facing the heel hole and then you need to place back the asymmetrical pin. So to do that, I'm going to rotate the heel 180 degrees and then I can punch the pin. So we'll use the big pin drifter and the hammer. I can open the valve just to check everything is on place and we're done. So this operation is the same for the race 150 and the race 170. To know more about how to change parts on your bindings, please check out the next videos and have fun skiing. Enjoy, bye bye.